It's not something that you get to dump something on. It's not a big truck. It's it, a series of tubes. The internet is so complicated. Hi, Shashan. I'm back at work. In good health. Everything's cool. Here's your content brief. Can broadcast networks convince advertisers to pay more to reach a smaller audience? That's the big question at this year's Upfronts, TV's annual programming showcase designed to entice advertisers to commit media buys ahead of the upcoming season. To some, this glitzy homage to TV's historical dominance might seem quaint, like something you'd see on Mad Men. In today's digital on-demand mobile culture, competition for consumer attention can come from virtually anywhere or anytime. Now the race is on to catch up to viewer habits. ABC, TBS, and TNT will all offer live streaming, likely in a bid to fend off competitive services like Barry Diller's streaming startup Aereo. ABC is also partnering with Nielsen in an important test to measure ad campaigns in mobile apps. Fox is embracing the power of the tweet to keep audiences engaged in a partnership that will see TV clips distributed via the social network. And at the opposite end of the spectrum, ratings champ CBS mock the other networks for their digital mobile efforts, confident its programming alone is enough to keep people in their seats. There's no question broadcast is still the king, both in audience and in ad dollars. But it might not be too long before it has to share the crown. That's it for this week's brief. Until next week, keep your content fresh.